Welcome to the Burnouts and Rotor Blades YouTube channel. Um, I, I got this. Oh. Today on Burnouts and Rotor Blades, we're going to be talking about how to change a tire. But this time, girls are in charge. Next, we're going to talk about if you can't call someone for help, um, how to change a tire by yourself. For this video, we're going to try to just use the tools that come with this car. Are you actually taking them from the garage? So, <laughs> no. The Next, we're going to talk about what tools are in the car. We're going to remove this trunk floor. We're going to take this whole tool tray next to a flat tire. Take the spare tire out. <laughs> The next step is to loosen the lug nuts, and if you're not, and I'll show you a trick if you're not as strong as me. We're gonna use the jack to break the torque on the lug nuts. We don't want to take it any all the way off. We just want to break the torque. Now that's loose, we don't want to take it all the way off. We're gonna tighten it a little bit. Now we're gonna do that to all the lug nuts. The instructions to put the, where to put the jack are on the jack, but and I'm going to show you anyway. Most cars have a little divot, and you're going to slide it in at that point. And then you see this little bump under the car. You're going to be put it between these little these little bumps right on the jack. And now we can twist it by hand until it touches the car. And the secret is to wiggle it a little, so if you get stuck, wiggle it a little. If you're in soft ground or in sand, you can use one of the floor mats to put under it so it's more stable. When it's hard to do by hand, um, put the jack handle in there and start twisting it by, with the jack handle. And lifting the car. You only lift the car high enough to put the new tire on. Man, do you need some help? No, thank you. I got this. Now that the car is jack jacked up, we're going to take the tire off. We're going to use the lug wrench to t take off the lug nuts all the way. We're going to leave the top one to last. This is a Volkswagen, and it has lug bolts instead of lug nuts, so it may be weird. We're going to put this tire under the car, so if the jack falls, we don't get squished. Uh, now we're going to put the spare tire on. We're going we're gonna to load the jack so we don't have to lift the tire up while we're putting it on. We're gonna try to line it up with that. So we're gonna, we're gonna pull it back. And then try to line it up. And now that we got them lined up, we're just we're gonna put the top on it. Now we're gonna use the lug wrench and run the top one all the way down. Now we're going to take a lug wrench and tighten them down as best as we can in a star pattern. Now we're going to take the tire out from the car and lower the jack. Now we're going to use our body weight to tighten the lug nuts more. <laughs> Girls, that's how you change the tire. And 
you should be heading to a tire shop because that tire won't drive forever. All right. Hey, done. I did the hard way, so you're going to do the hard way. Oh. What? <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe if you like the content and want to see more like it. And as always, thanks for watching. Today we're doing rotor. Uh, Today we're doing rotor blades. No, no, no. Today at Burnouts and Rotor Blades. We're Today on Burnouts and Rotor Blades. Today on Burnouts and Rotor Blades. We're use gonna use the jack to break the torque on the lug nuts. We're gonna use the jack to break break the tor on the torque. Torque on the lug jacks. Lug nuts. Safety should be your first concern. Nailed it. Nailed it. All right. What's next. What concern even? Mean? Con